the replica set and deployment and the differences and we can see what is replica set replica set is nothing but it can always ensure that desired number of parts are all are running at all times okay so what is the purpose here to maintain the maintain high availability of maintain the high availability by keeping number of parts running at all times and if part fails or is replaces automatically so what are the features so we'll discuss about the features that means declarative declarative in the sense via ml file not sorry ml or in the command line interface so with the help of ml or command line interface we can define the desired state and with the help of self-healing you know what is that means self-healing if pod fails uh, replica set will automatically replaces the failed pod or deleted pod without a human intervention automatic pod creation i can say okay next is scalability what is scalability scalability is nothing but you can scale the number of pods uh, based on your requirement with the help of uh, scale up and scale down easily scale up and scale down okay so these are the then we will discuss about the key points api version we need to mention apps v1 so next kind is replica set template so where we can define our pod with the label match label and selector these are the key fields selector attribute with the match labels we can specify this template and selector match label should match otherwise it will not be executed and i can give you the short tip here so you don't want to create the replica set directly so you can create deployment instead which will handle the updates and rollbacks uh, more easily.